Welcome back to Let's Play Spider-Man. I'm Burning Dog Face. And, uh... Things are tough in New York right now. Shout out to Justin Jones, who says, Yeah, Otto has definitely gone a little insane. Just a little. And now, Sable has gone into full cell mode. Not that any of us are surprised. And, uh, one final thought there or there in the episode, uh... Oh, Alex, I mean Jameson, just keep shifting those goalposts. <laughs> uh, shout out to Clunk279, who says, As powerful as Electro is, it's a good thing that his lack of brains and imagination often limits him to being only a street-level villain. And how? Yeah. That guy could be some serious danger. As I recall, the sequel to uh, Spider-Man 2000, the N64 game, was entitled Spider-Man 2 Enter Electro, where uh, he was trying to get his hands on a device called the Bio-Nexus device, BND, if I remember correctly. I never played that one, but I did uh, look into it, and uh, a friend of mine played that and told me a bunch of stuff about it. Uh, basically, someone invented a device for the purposes of uh, the pursuit of clean energy, that amplifies a human being's natural bioelectricity to the point where a normal person who uses the machine could then power a city block. Electro wants to use it because it's going to give him godlike power and enhance everything he has up until just the nth degree. And when I say godlike power, I mean at one point in that game, Thor apparently shows up to tell Spider Man how concerned he is. Oh boy. But, uh, yes! We're heading off to this bomb challenge to see if I can earn some uh, challenge tokens. Because I have been putting off that last gadget too long, and it would be nice to see the full wheel here. But first. Uh, e underscore Kristen says, Hey, Mayor Osborne and Sable, leave, clap, Spider-Man, clap, alone, clap, you, clap, cowards. <laughs> Number one brushhead says, One of those Sable goons broke my brother's jaw. When will the mayor answer for it? Pressure him, JJJ at home. Ada underscore Schwartz says, I didn't realize I lived in the middle of a war zone. And then a gritted teeth emoji. Darren G. says, Spidey's doing the job Sable should be doing. Just stopped a hostage situation. I think the... Are you going to come back and pick up all this freaking trash you just threw everywhere? Is about me throwing uh, garbage cans and such at people. Huh. Oh, fuck. V underscore Katrina says, Shelves are bare everywhere. Not sure how long until my fridge is empty. Getting kind of scary. Esmeralda G says, SM's leading the resistance, just freed some protesters from Sable. Ada underscore Schwartz pops in again to say, the ratio of villain to hero seems off by a wide margin these days. Oh, and here's our buddy Phil Chang saying, New York feels like a war zone right now. Biological weapons, militarized checkpoints, quarantine, it's really scary. Yeah. Yeah, it can be, doesn't it? Uh, Guapo Carlos replies, Don't forget Rhino knocking over buildings, Electro zapping the power grid, and who knows what else, sad face. Ada underscore Schwartz says, Finally getting those Sable agents out of my apartment and getting to go back home. Thanks, NYC wall crawler. What? Oh. Jesus Swanson says, Was that a missile that just shot off the roof next to my corner office? Come on, NYC wall crawler, get it under control! Ada Carlson replies, No need to shout, it's under control. Whoa, near missile! Mere missile. JK, it's all under control. Oh, man. Now we're getting into it. Miranda B says, Please pray for my brother Sam. He's sick with the stuff they're calling Devil's Breath on the news. I'm so worried I haven't slept in days. Willie L says, Girl, get some sleep. You worrying yourself sick isn't making him any better. My thoughts are with you and your brother. M. Jonas says, I really hope NYC Wallcrawler can tie all this horrible up soon. Eula McGuire, uh, underscore, says... The streets of NY are filled with trash, masked gunmen, and otherworldly potholes. 
Darren underscore M says, I know what you're going to say, and why it was already like that, la 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 la. Harry Mack says, this is where the literal and metaphorical meanings of all these words get real important. Oh, and here's a message from Sable International. Due to the quarantine of Manhattan, Sable International is increasing our security presence throughout the city to ensure everyone's safety. Doyle Smith says, safety? One of you jerks broke my nose at a checkpoint. Oh, and the haiku guy pops in. Haiku for you says, Sable rises up. Authoritarian might. Whose side are they on? Not bad. Uh, I had a shout-out in real life. From... Ah, yes, the ratio of villain to hero seems off by a wide margin these days. Shout-out to Derek Floyd, who says there wasn't enough in the budget for a crossover event. So Spider-Man has to save New York without the help of the Avengers, the Fantastic Four, Doctor Strange, Daredevil, or the Heroes for Hire. And I've said it before, and I will say it again, there are a lot of superheroes in New York. Was that a sniper beam? That was a sniper Stable beam. ground teams need a status report from Upper Chinatown. Observation post up. We'll relay any priority sightings. Alright, I got 5,330. That was the dumbest way I could have said that last time. I need to get 7,000 big ones in order to get spectacular on this challenge. Get to those bombs. I don't have much time. From right to left, let's go. Get up. Ah! Got all turned around. I'm going to start that over. Got all turned around thanks for the fucking... building having to... It kept redirecting me. I tried to sw shoot myself upwards with the, uh... the fire escape, but it just sent me sideways. Okay, took care of that one. I gotta find the last bomb. Where do I already know where they are? Or did Taskmaster literally just call me and say, Hey, they're here, here, and here. Do something in 50 seconds or everyone dies. Good, but I can do better. Yeah! Spectacular! And look at that. Two challenge tokens. All right. I can finally put this to rest. The Suspension Matrix lifts enemies into the air and holds them there for a short duration. Huh. No achievement for that. Upgrades. Huh. Doesn't use nothing but challenge tokens. Well, now I've, slapped, I've tried this uh, thing, the Concussion Blast, around a few times. So it increases maximum shots. Yeah, let's do that. Wider concussive blast. Sweet Jesus, let's do it. Give that a shot like that first. I don't like to upgrade things as much as I possibly can at one point because I feel like I miss the feeling of how they're upgrading. You know? I want to notice. Convict Joyride. Complete crime within two minutes. Stop the crime without taking damage. It can't be. It can't be. Fucking A, man. Okay. What I'm going to do is armor up. Oh, I don't have that. And I can't get that. That's why it's not lit up. I have this armor, though, so that's nice. In fact, that's the one that uh, gave me that other ability. Oh, God. Let's do this. 
Black and gold, baby. Move it or lose it. It is a car. I gotta shut this convoy down. This vehicle's been recalled, and so have you. Out you go. Oh shit! Stuck that car. But there's still another one. Oh hey. Yeah! Maybe they should start offering driver's ed in prison. I mean, it's not the thug crime that I really wanted to do, but... I did it! I didn't take any damage at all, and I beat it in two minutes! It is a good day for Spider-Man. And now, put the lights back on. That's better. Let green be the light of hope. Oh, I've had numerous callers today reporting that entire city blocks are being taken over by escaped inmates from Rikers. Oh, good. These are literal no-go zones in the heart of Manhattan. A dystopian future from 70s movies come to life. Why don't the police stop it, you ask? Oh, you're going to love this. It seems the prisoners ambushed a convoy carrying weapons and ammunition for the authorities and took it all for themselves. The police are outgunned by their own guns! Well, all right, this is where the rubber meets the road. This is where we see if Sable International and Spider-Man hey. are the protectors they claim to be. These criminals aren't hiding. They're right in plain sight, daring to come get them. Well, we're waiting! There's a red dot just down there. Let's find out what happened when I go down there. Control. Need a status update on Gramercy. Checkpoint secure. Be advised. Region highly the... genetic. Up there. Why is there a red dot here? Oh. Oh! That's why. There's a whole fucking squad of Sable guys just hanging out you here. Know, I don't mean to overreact, but I'm starting to take this personally. Close enough for that to work. Shit! Now I'm just embarrassed. Stable teams, this is control. Oh, hey. What's the status in Murray Hill? Oh, that really worked. That actually reminds me. Speaking of which, yeah, it's wider, all right. Oh, no! I don't think he liked that. I used the uh, the concussive blast on a guy, but there was a wall behind him, so he just slammed into it and fell forward. Oh no. What did that say? M. Jonas says, Everyone in our building is boarded up on the top floor and we're safe. Help each other out, band together, we can make it through this. Huh. Changbot. What, what, since when did he make posts of his own? Says, AI-powered dynamic algorithms could be leveraged to mine historical crime data and predict the likelihood of crimes occurring at specified locations before they happen. And then replies to itself, saying, hashtag AI is the future. Huh. Vilma K. says, Convicts stole my car and went on a freaking joy ride. Anyone know what a buff-out Spider-Man-shaped dance? <laughs> oh no. I guess there would be feet on the top of it now, wouldn't there? Ellis Stanley says, uh, MJ Watson Jackpot, I love your article. You're the only one showing NYC the real truth. W underscore Howard says, Classes were canceled again due to devil's breath. Not sure whether to be happy or very concerned. Oh, here's a fun fact. W. Howard is, uh, 
actually a maternal ancestor of uh, Dr. Beverly Howard, uh, nay, who later became Dr. Beverly Crusher and served on board the Starship Enterprise. Yes, I do know a Star Trek character's maiden name. Why? <laughs> Just off the top of my head. Soy Glorious is bombings, gangs, prison breakouts, bioweapons, always something awful going on in this town. Might be time to consider moving, if they ever let me out. Hamlet F. says, take to the streets and protest this authoritarian regime. Down with Osborne! Although the part I take from that is, really, Hamlet? Oh, hey, here's Brad Davis QB. Escaped convicts in the streets? People sick? What is happening to New York? Okay. Jeffrey underscore Medro says, saw cars flying down the road in my normal path home. Decided to take a detour. Grit teeth emoji. GLNYC wall crawler. Nice. Good luck indeed. Brent, uh, burnt underscore emit replies, was there a two for one sale on rocket launchers? Luz Snyder says, make sure you look both ways before crossing the street. Hashtag spider safety first. Robin Powell says, I really wish I could say I'm surprised that our city is overrun by prisoners and mercenaries, but I'm not. The only thing I regret is not leaving. Oh no. Edward Dwagon, or e Edward Dagon, rather, says, Please help! Convicts are on my roof trying to get in! Not a joke! Please contact police and send them to Chinatown by Confucius Plaza. Really? Th oh. I Ibenson says, Really think I'd have to hide in my own home all the time if the kingpin still controlled the streets? Doubt it. Oh, boy. I'd imagine my permanent record isn't looking too great right now. I should take on one of those prisoner camps. It was suggested to me that that might be a good way to... Okay, get experience with Sable. That was a lot of damage! Was that a sniper on the ground? Or is that guy just that fucking good? Again? No, I get it. It's not like the city has real problems. Oh, that is a sniper. Where is that? There! Oh god, when the, sni uh, the Sable snipers fire... It instantly creates a beam along the entire length of their laser. Like, it's one of those, uh... Oh, what do you call it? Uh, uh, uh... Fucking hey, I'm picturing that weapon from Quake 2. The railgun! A railgun, where by the time you finish pulling the trigger, it's already at the target. Yes! Okay, take care of that guy. Let's throw some more garbage around, make some things worse. Honestly, I feel like that would make it worse. Sure, I won the fight, but I bet they get medical benefits. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. Why did I even come to this part of town? Ah, finger guns, oil painter. I see you, Marcus David. Hot damn, there is just so much going on. Where does Wyatt spread? Sable shoot to kill on Spider Man. Good time to cosplay. He's on the phone. Oh no! Oh, I swear to God, if we find a story about how uh, the fake Spider-Man got shot, I am not going to be happy about it. Like, every person in a Sable uniform will have a concussion by the end of that day. Not a good day to be Kips Bay. Food... Uh, food convoy raid. Oh, hell no. 
Web throw five objects at enemies. Web throw five objects. I can't web throw objects, just people. Oh, no, 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 just the regular throwing. What am I talking about? Da, 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 da. I, th I think web throw, I think of the one where you have to web them up first. My bad. And then achieve a combo of 20 or more. Let's see if I can do that. Looks like those inmates have hostages. Gotta be careful. Mods do I have equipped? Uh, bullet resistance, healing, and uh, melee resistance. Sure. I'm going to go ahead and equip that. Next time I fight Sable, I should put on Spider Punk. Just to freak out uh, Jameson. Missed. Can I sit at the cool kids' table? One, two, three. Oh, that one had powers. Four. Ow. Five. Now I just need to achieve a combo of 20 or more. Hey, I'm really badly hurt. Such a dummy, and I've not noticed these things. Tell you what, uh, oh, that wasn't it. It was this one. Absorb some incoming damage without resetting the combo counter. Uh, yes, bio mesh, and we'll swap it out for the bullet ones, and hope I don't get shot. Oh, fuck that. Oh, fuck this. I'll just lay into that guy. No! Oh! Nice! Okay. Someone get him down here! Damn it. Twenty! Mmm! Both objectives! Stealing food from the needy. Talk about eroding your faith in humanity. Right? You're a mensch, Spider Man. If these guys just went to peace, May would feed them same as everyone else. I mean, everyone in the city knows I May. Knew Jameson was wrong about you. Looks <sighs> like so they got here on motorcycles. There's just a shitload of them around. Oh. More and more listeners are warning that the mayor's sable agents, ostensibly here to protect us, are behaving more like a. Be sending civilians after me? Hey! Everywhere. You dumb fucker. I'll kill you! I'll call this guy an ambulance. Hope they can help him. Uh, we're standing next to, well, there's the food truck, and right next to it is an overturned, uh, sable truck, which is very badly damaged, and has two dead sable guys on the ground next to it, along with the laser blaster turret, which appears to have been ripped clean off of the roof of the vehicle. And when I say clean off, I mean I can't actually see where it would be mounted, which is weird. Maybe they just had this one sat on top and hope no one would notice. But, uh, I'm gonna run to the top of that building, and then we'll, uh... Listen to Jameson again, because we can. And, uh, call it an episode. Collections! Let's see. JJJ Archives. Occupiers. More and more listeners are warning that the mayor's sable agents, ostensibly here to protect us, are behaving more like an occupying army. But let's hear it from the caller. Go ahead. They won't let me in my building. Said it's quarantined. I said, fine, let me in and I'll stay there. They pointed their guns at me, ran me off like a criminal. I got no place to go. Caller, this is deeply disturbing to me. I promise you, I'll bring it to the attention of the proper authorities. Emergencies do not permit the suspension of human rights. Your elected officials may not be willing to fight for you, but J. Jonah Jameson is. Oh, boy. How lovely.
I'm Burning Dog Face, and I will see you on the next episode of Let's Play Spider-Man. When the war against this chaos continues, and we continue looking good while doing it. <laughs> Have yourselves a great day till then, Burning Dog fans. Later.